a lot of people asking about how to clean like linen or cotton. I clean this all the time. The thing is I charge more because it's harder to clean. Let's say if I charge a regular sofa, example like 150, if it is linen or, or cotton, I would charge 250. But uh, I use the regular spray spray, like upholstery spray spray. Uh, if you have like uh, something with peroxide, if it's brighter color, it would help in the cleaning. Of course, the yellowing areas, you, you, I, I, that's the way I do it. I, I put like a peroxide, 20% peroxide to help out to clean the, the yellowing and browning. But uh, I don't see much secret, but of course, it's harder and takes longer to dry. But uh, you got you to explain to people that uh, it's going to take long to dry if they want a good job. I did a... I did one another day, this lady called me and uh, she had a almost $6,000 sofa and she hired this guy. She said she thought everybody would be the same, would do the same cleaning and she... Um, uh, and she, then she said after three weeks she started to see like yellowing watermarks showing up on the sofa. Very expensive sofa with like cotton fabric. And uh, she said they took like one hour and a half to do the job, but uh, it took me like uh, more than four hours to fix the, the service. She gave me a good tip and, uh, and she was really happy with the job, but uh, it, was, uh, it was really, really hard to clean the yellow marks that the guys left behind because they tried to do something called, I don't know, VLM or dry clean. I don't know. I don't, I never, I, I don't do that one. I just use... Like, uh, I, I wash with water. In my opinion, if you want to clean something, you got to use water. Of course, you got to do more dry, dry times with the, the tool, but uh, that's my opinion. That's way, that's how, how I do it. So I hope, uh, I hope this video helps.